WFMY News 2's Jalen Gilkey is live in Dallas tonight where Duke and NC State will go head to head tomorrow. He spoke to DJ Burns' parents about their son's rise to stardom. Jalen, how did Burns become the face of NC State's Cinderella st story? Yeah, Amber, every March Madness, the nation finds a new favorite face, whether that be Michael Jordan in 1982, Steph Curry in 2008, or Jimmy Fredette the year after that. Well, March of 2024 belongs to none other than the DJ Burns Jr. from NC State. And today, we talked to his parents about their son's newfound superstardom. I felt like he was about eight years old when I knew, I saw it when he got uh, better than us when, it, when we coached his little league team and he was beyond even our uh, skill set. I'm like, this kid can dribble, he can move, he's got good footwork. We gotta, you know, take this further. And he loved the game. DJ coming out of high school was very heavily recruited. We allowed him to go to school a year early. Um, looking back, hindsight being 2020. No knock to nobody, it was just it wasn't, he wasn't ready. And Coach Barnes like, did his just do and made sure he got home safely. So um, Winthrop was a perfect shot, spot for him to continue to mature and grow. It was a blessing, but coming to NC State has now become an even bigger blessing because anybody that knows us as a family, the first thing they're going to hear his mama say is bigger than basketball. The legend of DJ Burns feels like he's larger than life not just in Raleigh or in North Carolina, but now he's a national treasure. For me, it was a culmination of all he'd been through. When he was named the MVP, I don't think he expected it. I don't even think we expected it, to be honest with you, but it wasn't about a trophy. It was about the moment for him to have put it all together and everything that he had been taught from us as parents, from his village, from his coaches, um, just to see it all come together in that moment. That was the old and the young felt a sense of pride with this group that um, right now is unmatched because they're starting to break records that we hadn't seen in a while. So I feel like um, the guys are bringing in a lot of pride that they deserve. The fans deserve that. They deserve for these guys to be doing exactly what they're doing, and that's given 100% of everything they got to make sure that NC State is on top. And if you weren't quite sure why this young man seems so lovable, I'm sure you have a better idea. Now his parents are great. We also talked to DJ today and asked him about how important it is to have such a strong support system, and this is what he had to say. I would say that support system is the only, or main reason I'm, I'm here now, you know. Um, without them, this would be, I wouldn't be close to where I'm at now. I wouldn't even, I might not even be playing basketball, you know. Um, they made sure that I stayed on the straight and narrow path, but they also allowed me to have a, a personality, and that's, you know, kind of how, how I grew up, and that's how things, that's why things are the way they are now. And coming up in sports, I, we'll have more for you from Dallas. I'll see you in 15 minutes.